Dick Rochford here in the M600. W wanna do a brief demonstration of the pressurization system in this aircraft the pressurization system is pretty much fully automatic but you do have to set it up to begin with for example um, if if you would Luis put uh, in the flight plan put Mike Tango in November as the destination just clear out the destination or change it you could I think have said select destination airport and would have changed it okay Mike Tango November all right, let's see what happens here. Uh, destination altitude, 22 feet. And now we've asked it um, for a pressurized cabin. Uh, it knows to go to whatever differential pressure we need uh, to satisfy that pressurized cabin. We have three controls here. We have an inflow, an ECS, bleed air select, which is basically the volume of air, uh, either none, off, s normal, high, or emergency. So the three volumes are off, none, normal, high, and emergency. Next, we have a covered switch that says cabin press. We have 1.7 differential pressure right now with the correct airport in and an altitude uh, at, at 3,500. So we have um, you know, plenty, of, uh, plenty of breathable air at the correct pressure. If we got smoke in the cabin uh, or needed to dump the cabin for some reason, smoke is probably uh, the most cogent, we would lift the cover, the spring-loaded cover, and I want you to do that now, and press the cabin press dump. Press it. Yep. Right. And now let go. Ooh. No, let go. Ooh. Yeah. All right, so we get a 1.7 PSI loss of pressure. Yeah. Goes to zero. <laughs> and the cabin altitude starts to climb up to 3,500. No surprise, we've dumped the cabin. The other thing that you notice is that we get adiabatically chilled air in here. So that's the cabin dump. If if there were smoke in here, it would now be gone. If somehow smoke were coming from the engine compartment, we would also want to pull out, do that now, pull out the bleed air. And you notice that quiets the cabin because there's no rush of air coming in. And then turn the ECS to yep. off. Now we'd like to repressurize, um, and there's a couple ways to do this, depending on how fast you want to do it. <clears throat> but I would recommend the normal way would just be to push the inflow in open okay. and turn the ECS to normal, and now close the dump, which closes the outflow valve electrically, electronically. Now you hear the mass flow sensor beginning to pressurize. Yes. If you wanted this cabin to come back quicker than it's coming back, spin that over to high and then on over to Emer. Emer. Woohoo! It's dramatic, but it might save your life someday. So you see, it's coming back at five, 400, 500 feet a minute. Dick Rochford flies safely. Train often.